Recently finished a sign and I just built the base. It needs some cleaning up. I tried using acetone and it didn't work that well. I'm resulting to the best thing I found on the internet, equal parts of salt, vinegar, and flour. And hopefully this works to clean it. When you mix equal parts of iodized salt, vinegar, and flour, it turns into a paste-like texture. After putting on some disposable gloves, I just lather it on. Even with a light application, you can start to feel the debris just peeling right off of the copper. The coolest part is the results are instantly noticeable. A light application of the mixture really only needs a couple minutes to sit, but it's neat to see the before and during, during the process. Here is one side with the paste application and the other one without. All right, so I am gonna let that paste sit for about 15 minutes, but you can tell it's already doing the job. I also tried using acetone first and it didn't do that well. So that's why I panicked and tried to find something different. I do like that it is just vinegar, salt, and flour. So it's natural ingredients and no harsh chemicals. So let's see how it does. Oh, the only downside is Brindley. What'd you say it smelled like? Throw up. She said it smells like throw up but we'll see how it does. Once it was completely coated, I actually just started wiping it off with a little bit of acetone on the side that I started with. I actually noticed that it didn't really seem to matter if I used acetone or not, so I just used dried paper towels to clean off the rest of the stand. I absolutely love the results and especially love that I didn't have to keep scrubbing it with acetone. It was just so easy to put on the paste and wipe right off within a few minutes. It instantly made a difference and the whole process was very quick. It probably took me under 30 minutes to do and it's nice and squeaky clean, all ready to be delivered and to display a sign for our client. And if you think that this tutorial has been helpful for you, make sure that you follow along for more tip talks and head on over to YouTube and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm so grateful that I get to work with you guys every day.